So this van is set up with seating for four people and sleeping for two. The second row seat has three-point seat belts and folds. The front two seats have seat swivels. And there's quite a lot of storage in this van. So you'll see up above, we have a headliner storage shelf. We have a beautiful beetle kill pine ceiling. We have ventilation up above with our fantastic fan powered roof vent. And then over here we have Arctic Turn dual pane acrylic windows. These are really slick windows. They have a setup so that you can have all shade as we have right now, or you can have all screen, or you can open these shades and screens. And then the window itself actually tilts out on gas struts. So this window has several opening positions and it provides plenty of airflow right across your kitchen area here. You can keep this up in many different positions or you can have it in a closed position so that you can even have it in a semi-closed position when you drive, allowing for a little bit of airflow. And then of course, complete privacy with these shades. Here's our main control panel, and we have our touch sensitive panel for our electrical components here. Here's our hot air heater control panel, and we have our two AC outlets, our two DC outlets, our hot water heater control panel, and our main switch panel. So here's the control panel for our LED light strips, then for our water pump, then for our USB ports in the back, then for our refrigerator, and here you can see we have a two burner induction cooktop. And then we also have a 12 volt DC compressor fridge. This is a Novacool R4500, which is a 4.3 cubic foot refrigerator freezer. Very electrically efficient with a sealed compressor. And we have tons of cabinet space in this conversion. We have many of these upper cabinets, which are very sturdy, beautiful, clear-coated, seven-layer plywood cabinets out of Baltic birch plywood. Soft-closed bloom hardware. And back here, we have the flare space bed system. And this bed system includes the two-panel flare space bed, the flare space mattress, which is customized to fit the flares, flares with trim rings, and flare space screened half slider windows with touch sensitive puck lights above and USB ports inset into each trim ring. And then above the bed, you can see that we have a 12 volt Dometic RTX 2000 air conditioner, which provides plenty of cool for comfortable sleeping even in hot nights. And over here, we have a kitchen galley cabinet and this galley cabinet has a Torva deep sink and our faucet is actually a swiveling faucet that also has a pull-out spray head. I can have a spray pattern or just a continuous flow. And then I also have a flip-up countertop section also made out of the same butcher block as the rest of our countertop so that we extend our cabinet area and our countertop space a little bit. And then that's easily collapsible, so you can get in and out. And then over here, this whole side is upholstered as well. And we also have another Arctic Turn dual pane window for better visibility and airflow. So in the back here, we have an Illumines rear door ladder and tire carrier. And we have a full size 17 inch wheel and spare. So you have easy access to your spare. And then um, this ladder enables you to have easy access to the roof. So if you wanted to lash down any other equipment or check out your solar panels or your air conditioner, that helps you get up there. Let's open these doors and see what's inside. On the rear of the van, you can see that there is even more storage. This storage area, these two six foot drawers are very useful for storing any kind of equipment you have, like climbing gear, camping chairs, toolboxes, any of those kinds of things. Then these two wheel well cabinets are our systems cabinets. So in here is our water system cabinet. And in our water system cabinet, we have our 30 gallon water tank, 
Then we have our Bosch hot water heater. And we also have an exterior shower here. So here is a port which has a pull-out head for the exterior shower. There's our spray nozzle and we have about six feet of hose. And then here's our mixer valve that controls the temperature of our exterior shower. Up here is the fill port for our water system and it just screws off and allows you to connect to it with your average variety garden hose. Very convenient so any garden hose can just connect into that and you can fill up your water tank. Then on our other side is our electrical cabinet. And our electrical cabinet contains a full Victron electrical system. And here we have a 2000 volt compact multi-plus inverter, two 30 amp DC to DC chargers, our Serbo GX communications unit, the main battery shut off, and 300 amp hours of Battleborn lithium batteries. And then we have tons of storage space in between these two real well cabinets that allows you to put in your bikes or kayaks or whatever other equipment you carry with you and allows you to have full pass-through capability into the main part of the van. We also have some storage pockets on the rear doors that can be used for clothes, shoes, whatever you need to store. This van also comes with some window covers, a pair of window covers for the rear Flare Space 1033 slider windows, and a nice high quality windshield cover up front that gives you plenty of privacy. And then this Mercedes van is also equipped with the new seven inch touchscreen. And this touchscreen allows you to display any of the apps that you would typically use with your smartphone. So you can plug in your smartphone here into this charging cable, which is included with the van, and then connect any of the apps that you would usually use. And it start up, starts up Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. And then you can tuck it away in this compartment while you're driving. Wouldn't this be a sweet van to take on your travels?